so evidently we're going to do that this with this again though he is purring and he is beautiful and he is smart he is also a little bit needy today no gnome used the tail sucker so there there is displeasure in that regard so today is vlogmas day 12 we are continuing apace but it's also the first day of vastmas which i've mentioned once or twice on here that i really enjoy live stream rpgs and my ride or die favorite is vast <laughs> which you can only watch on Project Alpha, which is a joint effort between Nerdist and Geek and Sundry. They, they have like a couple of the first season episodes up on the Geek and Sundry YouTube, I think. I think that's how I got sucked in. No, that's not how I got sucked into it. I got sucked into it on a whim after I had subscribed to Project Alpha. So, sci-fi RPG? Sure, why not? I think I picked it up during last December's? What's it called? Hiatus in all of Project Alpha and Geek and Sundry's programming because evidently LA closes down for like a good two weeks in December as far as the entertainment industry goes. Vast News, which is a Twitter, decided to have a vastness. 12 days of vastness. And today is day one and it's tell us your favorite Tell us who your favorite Vastronaut is, which is our fandom name. We're, we're Vastronauts. We chose this ourselves. I, I think it's kind of clever. I'm weird that way, though. And it's like everybody I've met in the Vast community is fantastic and wonderful and lovely. But my, And the entire cast is just phenomenal. They, they are the, the kindest, sweetest people and are just as flummoxed by us as we are by them. So, you know, it's all good. The, the legitimately, my two favorite people on the show are Sam DeLove and Max Isaacson, just because Sam DeLove is my, my, my non-binary baby. They are also just ridiculously intelligent and love opera, and my, my list of reasons for loving Sam DeLove is long and ridiculous. And Max Isaacson is the most, his character, Visionary Destroyer, is simultaneously the most bloodthirsty, murderous space cockroach, who is also the most empathetic and the most wanting to save her people. It's so strange, but so perfect, and Max does it so well. And then you throw the two of them together because their characters are bond mates, and yeah, it's just like perfection. I also just really love Colin Kelly and Amanda Powers, just their existence, and Jodie Hauser is amazing, and, Amy, and internet sensation Amy Dallin is wonderful, everybody is wonderful in the cast. But this is about the astronauts, not the cast. I have like a top three. I have Anne, who is basically our, our, our <laughs> basically our queen. Anne is our uh, Scooby Peer facilitator. She's our den mom. She makes sure everybody who comes into the community feels welcome. But she does things like sets up an, a week long conference in our Discord so that we can listen to the cast talk about their character development and things like that. And we can talk to them. And that was kind of great. <laughs> but Anne makes everybody feel welcome. And of co course, I actually don't know this person's. IRL name, her handle is not a lizard. <laughs> and I, I refer to her as lizard in my everyday life because we, we, we are friendly acquaintances burgeoning upon friends. I, I would say Anne and I are, are, are loose friends working towards more, more steady friends. But not, not a lizard is just she's wonderful and weird and quirky and as awkward as I am and we have a lot in common, and we've had a lot of similar issues this year. But she she also made me feel incredibly welcomed into the into this community. Hello, sweet boy. He's just getting bigger and heavier all the time, isn't he? And then there is Alex. And Al Alex is interesting because I legit <laughs> we're not sure how we ended up following each other. We we. we we have decided it had to do with Vast, 
But until we had that conversation, I thought I had met him at Anime Milwaukee and he had thought I was a different vendor and I had helped him find the vendor they were looking for. But evidently I confused Alex with somebody else in that regard. And Alex is a darling. He is the sweet, sweetest kid. And I enjoy talking to him and we have, again, lots of things in common. And again, I would say loose friends becoming stronger friends. I, I'm I'm very I'm very bad at okay I shouldn't say I'm bad at making friends I'm good at making friends I'm bad at keeping friends because I have a tendency to be too much for everybody and that's a gnome wandering around back there I I do I have a tendency to be too much of everything for everybody and I have accepted that and I have moved on but yes those are the three astronauts that are the most important to me and there are. are lots of others but when the, the question came up those were those and lizard and alex were my ride or die first thoughts so i'm gonna go and i will see you all tomorrow with a new vlogmas video and maybe i won't have a giant barnacle on my shoulder at that point in time courage in my hair. Alright, that's fine too.